Hey crew, I have found this abandoned hillside mansion that is in just the most beautiful location. But directly across from me, this is being destroyed for the sake of building more things like that. Through a lifetime of love and now a growing fear for our natural world, it is my mission to explore some of the planet's most breathtaking yet threatened landscapes, all in the name of promoting reforestation. We have all played a part in its destruction, and now we all need to play a part in its regeneration. We only have one world, and the future of it and all its inhabitants is in our hands. So join me as I seek out spectacular specimens and spruce social change. I am Kit, and these are my eco escapades. Hey crew, and welcome to Koh Phangan Island. Oh, I love this little tropical paradise just off the coast of Thailand. There are white sand beaches crystal clear water, a vibrant hippie culture right on the other side of the island, the famous full moon party, incredible food, but all of this is coming at a little bit of a cost for the natural environment. So let's dig a little bit deeper. All right, just gonna go and have a look. Not that I'm on the market for some land here. Just wanna go and see Know what type of condition the land is in that they're, that they're looking to sell. Ooh. I understand why they made this. This would be impossible otherwise. There's been a few roads that seem just get so washed away so easily. I don't know if the video would show this well, but this is pretty steep. Oh, gotta love this about uh, little river crossings. Just stop and clean my feet off. Just take in the surroundings. Just up there. That's what it should look like, sort of. Still coconut palms. <laughs> very beautiful. Oh, there we go. There's a perfect example of what's going on already. Uh, uh, so this is where there's actively building going on. At least for some of the substructure. Quite a few places being put in here, that is for sure. Alright, yeah. yeah. Quite a big development going on up here. Right in the middle of the dense jungle. Or what was done for dense jungle. Yeah, all at various stages, but I'm guessing 20, 20 individual. Fairly decent size houses. So I jump back on the road and well, it's only a couple of minutes around the corner and there's driveways heading off into the native jungle, newly formed driveways, and then I come across this just scar that has been ripped into the native forest and I couldn't help but go and have a little explore and understand what's happening. Seems to be a bit of the problem. All this land grab. This would have been dense jungle right here. It just cut straight through it. Imagining the plan is to build houses all up there and stuff, but whether it ever happens or not, not sure. But I definitely know that this is a bit of a problem. Yeah, so that was very confronting and literally on Google Maps, the most recent image in 2021, that was rich, luscious jungle. But just across the road, I saw a couple of these structures there on the left side. And that road thing, I'm like, well, my curiosity got the better of me. What is up here? Anything? I've got nothing. Okay, definitely something. That, I was not expecting, as you could not see that from the road. But, ooh -wee, what a spot though. <laughs> you saw coming up that steep road, really hidden down there. But right in the jungle here, it's absolutely I'm sure you can hear the, the sounds that are going on. We're just left with this semi-constructed shell right up here on the hillside. I 
wonder what happened. But here you see on the other, directly across from us right now, on the other side, all of that clearing of that land. Yeah, just get a load of this all over here. And I feel like going in there is not going into anything. So I don't feel it's about expanding a road or something. Definitely could be more to do with creating places like this that, <laughs> that hopefully don't end up in the same state. So let's hope this doesn't start to just cover all of that as well. Anyway, cool little find, don't you think? A bit of a sneaky look around this very much half finished structure and I'm assuming never to be completed. And it's just such a shame to see the amount of energy and waste that's gone into constructing something like this to just have it sit there totally useless. Ooh, it really is beautiful here. Just look at where I'm at. Absolutely gorgeous. But the thing is, is that it's easy to sit here and see so much of this development that has just destroyed so many of the other islands um, happening here on this beautiful island. Just here, over here, there is blocks of land for sale. I know that those houses over there are for sale. There is a beachfront development happening right down here. Up over on the hill here, you can see, I'm not sure if it's easy on the GoPro, most likely not, but there is burnt cleared land up there to the right of it farmland to the right of it a road going up that's looking like it's going to be developed into housing the coconut plantation that just sprawls and sprawls and sprawls the delicious delicious disappointment of this plantation ah it's it's gorgeous but it is being slowly slowly eroded away so hopefully there is somebody that's going to step in and um, you know really put a put a hold on things before it gets out of hand and just loses that beautiful appeal that this that this island has because it's just lovely. I'm absolutely in love with this place. I do not want to leave, and I'm excited for many more explorations around here, mm, especially into the water because doesn't that look good down there? Yeah, let's go swim with some fishes next time, eh? What do you reckon about that? Okay. Well, thank you for hanging out with me for however long this was. I do appreciate it. It's so lovely to have some company going around doing these things. And I will see you somewhere else on this island on the very next adventure. Thank you.